Hey guys, this is Pharaoh 291 and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts. And look, we got two enemies! Sweet! I believe his name is, a uh, Fat Body. I believe. Now what you want to do here, oh, you want to hit him in his back, that's the only way you can damage him at the moment. And when he charges like that, um, you want to try blocking it, but however, I'm sucking really bad. Um, if you do block it, you get like a couple points experience, so it's always a big plus. And he gives us seven experience points for even killing him. Sweet. And, um, yeah, so like what? We have like two or three new enemies right in this world. That's awesome. Um, now... Oh, and actually, if you guys noticed, this is my first 15-minute video. Woo! Go ahead and Goofy leveled up. Woo! <laughs> actually, you saw that he learned Treasure Magnet. I think I'm stupid, I don't I didn't equip it on him yet, but um, pretty much what it does, uh, if he's near a, uh, if he's near any type of treasure, he'll pick it up automatically, like, surrounding him, and if the whole group has it on, then you can, like, pick up everything, which is, like, double awesome. Uh, but yeah, 15 minute video, I'm testing this out. Um, I'm not really sure if I'm a big fan of it just yet, but I feel like it might help especially with our peers out there. So, eh, who knows. So what you want to do is move that rock. If you notice, that rock was blocking that exit, and for some odd reason when you push the rock in what I guess is water, um, two platforms come out. What's kind of weird, he pushes it in, I guess, where there's a pond, but you know, you walk on it like it's nothing. Wonderland is so jacked up, I'm not, <laughs> I don't know what else to say about it. But once again, the guy who wrote it was on shrooms, so... And I believe, did I get into the rant where a bunch of things in this world wouldn't be the way it, the way it is without the use of drugs? <laughs> I'm not promoting it, you know, I, I don't do drugs, you know, like you say, it's whack, crack is whack, and all that crap. <laughs> um... But I'm just saying, like, a lot of things out there, seriously, was the result of drugs. You know, a lot of music, a lot of industry stuff, I don't know. It's all weird, but that's our world out there. And, um... Oh, wait, did we get a new, uh, new enemy here? I don't know. I mean, I'm, maybe I missed it, who knows. Uh, but you saw a blue Trinity mark, so hey, you know what to do there, guys. Uh, where the hell is it at, though? There it is. Or, okay, maybe I'm not doing it yet. He wants a high potion. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to do that. Might as well, though. I mean, maybe we get something better. What do we get? Ooh, a mega potion. See? See what happens out of generosity, guys? Always give back, because you'll probably get something back more. I know it's not a good lesson at all, so... Disregard what I just said, you know? <laughs> um, the Queen's... You did wait. Wait, did I not do that Trinity Mark then? Um, hmm. Okay then. I have to check that out because I could have sworn I got it, but whatever. Uh, so yeah, when you take that exit, it takes you on top of the bushes, and well, that's cool at the moment, but we still can't reach the other stuff that was there. Ugh. <sighs> Am I going to get that Trinity Mark or not? I'm pissed off now that I... Unless I did it in that and like... Oh man, I don't know. I must be spacing out big time. Whatever. And more enemies. You know, I'm, I keep thinking that maybe I should cut these fights out, but it's like... Ugh, I don't know how to exactly just because this isn't... It's not like a regular RPG where like you can walk into the battles and like there's a transition into the battle. Here it's like... Boom! And it's like, oh, you know, you could edit it out, you know, but it's like, I just don't want to do it. Uh, I, if you guys haven't noticed, I'm a very lazy editor, so. And that's what, this is what The Rock was blocking, the tea party room. Um, oh no, there's the Mad Hatter and the rabbit, I don't know. And, uh, let's just read. A very merry unbirthday. Yeah, let's just sit down and get your present. So here, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like a game of chance or what. 
So you just sit down in like any of the seven chairs and you know, you, I guess you send a correct one you get items. So, and I, I think it's a game of chance because you know, I, and this, what I'm doing right here, this is the longest I went without actually, I guess, uh, failing it. Oh, okay, here's where I paused the game because my mom walked in. And I'm like, oh yeah, mom, mom. she's like asking, what are you doing? I'm like, um, I'm doing recordings. And she's like, oh, okay. I, I kind of found it funny. She wasn't even like questioning, like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should fill her in one day what I do on YouTube. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, so, wow, I remember I come, that's a huge-ass box. And it's Elixir, so, of course, that's why it's a big deal. Uh, let's see, so yeah, I just... I guess, I, I feel, I don't know if it's a game of chance or not. I was just sitting randomly on these chairs, and I'm like, oh, I'm doing so good, I'm doing so good. And I feel, I think you, like, you can stop, you stop playing whatever, sitting on these chairs, when you get the cake. And I believe it's right here. I only had two more chairs to go, and I sit on here. Oh no, there's a cake. And I get nothing. I get enemies. Oh yeah, that's a great gift, guys. But yeah, that's about it. Oh, yeah, and then you can see. Uh, well, I didn't show it just yet. Ooh, look, the picture changed. It's kinda, that's kind of creepy, though. Picture changing. Ugh. And if you see up there, there's some treasure chests up there, but I can't reach it because Sora cannot jump. He can do everything else, but he cannot jump high enough yet. So look, another exit into the bizarre room, and well, now look what happens. Ah, uh, the stupid cat. They're hiding somewhere. And the mummer, I, I couldn't say this word, mammoths out grab. I, I don't even know what the, if I'm saying that right. Want to find the shadows? Try turning on the light. Okay. Now I guess this is a supposedly supposed to be like a puzzle, riddle, whatever. It's so not hard. Oh look, down the level up. Sweet. Um, why the hell did I pause there? Hmm. Okay, I guess I'll meet you guys back when I unpause. Well, never mind there. <laughs> uh, I was gonna wait until, like, I was gonna cut that out, but I'm like, I screw it, it wasn't that long. See what happens when you when you post commentate. It pisses me off so damn much. But what can I do at the moment? So, oh, fat bodies. I, I don't know. Like the thing is, another thing I kind of failed to. Oh look, see I blocked it. Another thing I forgot to tell you guys is like, of course. Actually, I think I told you guys in the first part of my LP. Right in the beginning of the game, where you chose like between the sword and you chose between the. Um, the sword, the staff, and the shield, depending on which one you chose as your primary thing, you get, you level up differently, you know? Um, I always, any game I play, I always went for offense. That's, that's the type of guy I am. I want to deliver the pain and, like, to someone and deliver the damage. So I love going for more offensive characters, and that's why I chose the sword, so that's why Sora will be a lot stronger by the time the game goes on. However, if you chose like the shield or the staff, you guys would have gotten different things. If magic, of course, you would have gotten more magic. And with uh, the shield, you would have gotten more defense. And one of the first abilities would actually learn is guard. And that's actually a very useful technique. But I am not going to be getting it until like level 30, I believe. I, cannot, I, just, I seriously cannot remember, but... Um, yeah, but it's a very useful thing, and well, I just have to wait wait up on it. So here's what you gotta do: just touch the lamp, and that's it. It's too dim. Make it brighter. What next? One more lamp that you need to light. I don't know why the hell they said what's next. He just said, "Make it brighter." Sora is so stupid. All the lights are on. You'll see the shadows soon. They'll arise in this room, but somewhere else. The shadows might go after that doorknob, too. 
I might have to stop doing that voice because it's starting to annoy me. If it annoys me, then it might annoy you. Hmm. Okay, so he said that it's the uh, shadows are ever going to be in this room, but somewhere else. Which you pretty much mean that we had to get out of this, out of this upside down room, go back to the regular room where the doorknob is. Boom. Um, and that hatch, kind of like a shortcut, like once again, to the Queen's Castle. And I believe right there, that's all the world, that's every single room you can enter. Ooh, look at more Dalmatians. I believe now we have uh, two more chests to find with Dalmatians in. But seriously, out of all the worlds, I do believe... Well, actually, no, no, no. One world is way smaller than everything else, but um, out of the ones you can actually explore, this is by far, the, I believe, the smallest one. Oh, there he is again. You'll have a better view from higher up. I sure I am. I mean, what the hell did I just say? I sure I am? Wow. I really gotta go back to school. <laughs> Creepy cat. The shadows should be here soon. Are you prepared for the worst? If not, too bad. Oh god, what the hell does he mean? Oh no! What is that thing? It's another boss! I call him the construction paper of doom because that's what he reminds me of. See, his arms remind me of, like crumpled up construction paper or something, you know, some project you would do in elementary school. But he is a very simple boss also. Uh, you will see what I mean right now. Um, see, I guess you're, you know, if you can't reach him, uh, you have to you know, get up on the table, whatever. But, I guess if you angle it just right, uh, you can actually keep hitting that thing on the, cr on the crotch. Which, yeah, that, I would, that would bring anyone down, you know, so... Well, at least the guys. <laughs> See, look, just like that. And every time you bring him down, he gives you health. So once again, you should not lose this fight. I mean, this game is not hard, guys. I mean, yeah, there are some challenging parts, but they're always optional. Like, the story-wise, definitely not hard. In my opinion. And once again, I'm only playing this on normal mode, so... Definitely shouldn't be hard. I'm not really sure how it is on Expert, because I never got too far in Expert. But, you know, it still didn't seem too hard. And if you guys want to know, this thing is called... Uh, Trickmaster, I believe. Um, so yeah, look at Sora go. Keep smacking him in the crotch like that. He doesn't... He, he just doesn't give a damn. He doesn't care. What are the monsters have manhood too, you know? But, you know, Sora doesn't care. He's like, he's like, no, you shall not conceive any babies. And boom. Uh, Sora. He, and he, come on, Sora's at the age too where he realizes that, like, it's priceless to have your thing. And look, we got defense and we got scan, which I believe is one of the mo most awesome abilities there. I mean,. It is what it is. You can see the HP of enemies. I like seeing that just because it gives me like a sense of comfort knowing how much I damaged that person or the enemy. So there goes the construction paper arms and uh, oh, his heart flew away. See, that, that's the only thing that doesn't make sense. He's a heartless, but his heart flows away. Well, it's not really his heart, I, I'm assuming, but whatever. And we got Ifrit's horn, or, or Ifrit. Ifrit or Ifrit? Mm. And... Water wait, racket. Uh, I want to tell you guys something, but hold on. How's a doorknob to get any sleep? Yawn, yawn. Okay. Oh my god, keyhole. Oh, oh no, it's happening to my keyblade! Woo! Did you guys hear something kind of close there? What the hell? What was that? Something, something closed. Oh yeah, so Ifrit, random fact, in Arabic, Ifrit means demon. Just wanted to, you know, show, you know, share that with you guys. And we got Navi G piece. What does it do? You'll see. Later on. Splendid! You're quite the hero. If you're looking for Alice, she's not here. She's gone. Off of the shadows, into darkness. No. Let's go back to gummy ship. We might find another world. Find her another world. Okay, guys. That is it. 
thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time